Hey, Travis, can we get an audio video check uh, with the drone, please? It's that it's building. building here. That building, building. That building and Strozier, right? We're very excited to be here. Uh, this is an opportunity for FEMA to work with state and locals as well as the university to help develop standards for imagery capture. Right now, we've got an Inspire 1 uh, up hovering. And We're working with uh, FEMA Region 4 to develop a standard for drone imagery uh, that can be used as part of the preliminary damage assessment process, uh, which is a, a key point uh, after a disaster to get that recovery going. So uh, we're hoping that the, the UAS imagery, the drone imagery, can, uh, can help make that process faster uh, and more effective. It's important that we have uh, imagery on what happened first, um, what happened while the event was happening, and then the state it's in currently. So if we have all that imagery, it helps our folk who process this data uh, have an opportunity to make quicker decisions along with the municipalities. And what we're moving toward is a system where we don't do as many windshield uh, PAs where we're driving around looking at everything. Now, potentially, we could take this imagery, put it up on a screen or a board, and have the state and locals, as well as us, look at this imagery and make some decisions about just how bad uh, the effects were. Uh, with things like uh, with the unmanned aircraft systems, if we can do jobs uh, that don't put people uh, in danger, uh, then that's always a good thing. Uh, we're out. Thank you. We're out. Here. Thank you. Everyone's free crop. This is a great opportunity for us. We're happy to be here. And we'd like to thank FSU again for allowing us to come on campus and get this done.